Hello there, and welcome to my short and not overly exciting video on coding. This is the coding molecule, and in the following few minutes, I'm going to briefly cover words from how to synthesize the properties of codeine and where and how it acts. So, codes are a naturally occurring alkaloid, made in the sticky latex sap of the opium poppy seed pod, however, in very small quantities. Whilst it can be extracted, it's by far easier to create it via the synthetic route from morphine and a methylene agent in alkaline conditions, causing it to be created in vastly greater quantities than directly from the seed pods. Codeine is usually combined with other drugs such as paracetamol or ibuprofen to enhance their painkilling abilities, as codeine is an analgesiac. On its own, in much lower doses, it can also be used to relieve coughing or diarrhea, which we'll come back to in a bit. Codeine itself is a prodrug, which means the chemical is not actually the active ingredient, but instead, as the codeine passes through the liver, it is converted into morphine, which then gives the desired effects. When codeine arrives in the liver, the reverse of the synthesis occurs, the methyl group being removed and the hydrogen reattached to form the hydroxyl group, thus becoming morphine. The drug acts by binding to the opiate receptors in the brainstem and spinal column to achieve the antidiuretic, antitissuative and analgesic effects. Can also bind to the opiate receptors in the limbic system, causing euphoria and relaxation. Unfortunately, this drug can also be abused and lead to the slowing of breathing to the point of its stopping, coma and death. Thank you very much for listening to my short video on codeine, and if you'd like to refer to the rest of my assignment, uh, it will provide greater detail into the synthesis, properties and structure of codeine. Thank you very much.